So a common request is now that you have all this data in your Zoho CRM, you want to export it to Excel for whatever reason. Maybe it's reporting. Maybe it's just to do a little bit of data manipulation. Maybe it's to run some analysis. Although all that's possible within the Zoho CRM, sometimes it's easier to do it through an Excel sheet. So let's see how we can do that here. So this is the home page, but actually how you're going to want to do it is you're going to want to go and click this little wrench over here. So I'm going to do that. And then you see a bunch of different sections here, general user controls, channels, customization, automation, process management, and then data administration is where I'm going to stop. And so if we look, export's going to be the one that we're going to use. And when you get to this page, it's going to say, look at all your modules and ask you, which one do you want to export? So maybe you want to do a little bit of analysis on your leads. You can click leads. You'll hit export and say, are you sure? I'm going to say, okay. And then it's exported right here and it's downloaded. And I could click that and it's in an Excel sheet that I can use. So a couple things, or actually one main thing to note is the limit's 3,000 records using this method. So if you do have more than 3,000 records, the alternative is to do a data backup. So I'm just gonna hit cancel. And right under export here, we have data backup. So let's click that. And so what you can see is actually something in my system is already set up. So twice a month, a data backup exists. So I can see here that I have a log of all the backups that have already happened. So you see my last one was March 6th, and I can use that and I can start manipulating that. However, if I want something that's a bit more recent, I can do this button here. I can say download immediately, and then I'm gonna hit download. And what you can see here is a data backup is now scheduled, and it's gonna take a second, um, but it's now scheduled and it's preparing that data backup. So I'm gonna quickly pause the video. So it takes a little bit of time, but now the data backup is complete. And what you can see here is we get a data zip file here. And so these are gonna be all your Excel documents of each module, and then also all your attachments here. So I can click each of these, and you can see it's gonna start downloading. And then once I click that, I can open it up, and an Excel sheet of every single one of my modules will exist. And I can start using that, and I can do all those things that I wanted to do in Excel with this data backup. So those are the two ways you can export your data. So now feel free to go ahead and try this in your own system and best of luck. Thanks for watching this video. Please be sure to subscribe to the channel and leave any comments in the section below.